Welcome to a special Arius Wave video. I am going to be focusing on XLM today. I've done my research on XLM and I do believe it is one of those altcoins with massive potential. And the reason for that is because of the value and the utility that it will bring to the world once it's uh, it gets developed some more and and also once all these um, CBDCs are implemented and you know the platform is uh, you know becomes more refined. Now, in this video, I want to explain to you what I think this pattern is. Now, I look at cryptos as one specific pattern, which is evolving over time. Bitcoin being, you know, the main driver, but you've got to ask yourself, what is bringing on this particular pattern? And I, and I, ha I think it has a lot to do with the timing of when this particular coin came out um i don't think that this is going to be like an endless uh move up i do believe that we are looking at what would begin off as a b wave um and personally i do think that this particular pattern started off earlier but at the same time, we've only just seen uh, the price action since uh, 2017. So what I'm trying to say is, what I'm trying to say is that probably this was in development earlier. And uh, however, the pattern itself, to me, reflects a B wave. And if anything, just look at it as a zigzag. Now. Given that we're going to have a pretty insane run, mania, absolute mania in um, cryptos in general, uh, I'm of the opinion that we're going to see a move that is going to exceed the target. Okay. Now, there could be a couple of reasons for this. Uh, so let me just start by saying that the wave A length of wave A should be roughly the same length as wave C. And that's up to this line up here. So looking at the way that I use channeling using Arius wave techniques, you basically from the start of wave A to the end of wave E for B, uh, usually you'll get a movement to the top of the channel. So I do think this could potentially go to you know around thirty dollars depending on timing could be 45 it could be yeah around i'd say around that area uh things can happen pretty quick as you know in uh the world of cryptos so <laughs> it's absolutely insane but you know i'm just using my methodology uh I'm not a financial advisor, so if you like my analysis, that's great. If not, look, I'm just giving you my view. Uh, as I've mentioned before in previous, the last couple of videos, I did a deep dive into cryptos. Uh, I started buying and selling and trading and getting involved and, you know, researching and seeing what it feels like to use it, uh, understanding what it is and where it's going. Um, listening to a lot of videos and information that is available to try and understand uh, a lot of the background as well. So I may touch on XRP in another video soon, but I just thought I'd touch on this one first, just because I'm really interested in this particular coin. Um, I do think that it has a lot of utility and massive potential. So I do think this is a beginning of a pretty nice move up i think it will launch uh higher shortly uh, i just think there's a bit of consolidation first before that happens and i mean it's no surprise really i will get into the nitty-gritty of 
the exact waves I think that are occurring probably in another video, but I just thought I'd touch on, you know, what I think is happening here. Um, and, you know, it's, it's a pretty good investment. It's at a pretty good price. Uh, and it, I think it's going to go, you know, especially considering where I think this is going, I do think it will overshoot the target. But then we're going to see a correction in general across the board, the everything correction, I call it. So let's just see what happens at that point. Um, this is just an introduction to XLM uh, Stellar. Um, and obviously, well, if you know, these are the price of the lumens that are used in the transactions within the Stellar network. Um, so I do think that uh, there's a lot of uh, interesting things ahead because of the way that it's been designed. Um, there is a large supply of these coins. So I do think that perhaps it'll be a little bit slower to begin, but I think the upside is probably huge in the long run. Well, you could say the same thing for all of them, really, I suppose. Uh, let's just take it a step at a time. For now, let's try to reach the first target. Um, you never know what can happen in this uh, sphere. So, uh, yeah, uh, hopefully you found this video interesting and informative. Thank you for watching.